I'm sticky. Forget these little kids. I'll take you to Big Town where the Mungos, I mean where the grown-ups live. I'm headed there now. Big Town? You've never heard of it? It's where all the grown-ups go. Well, at least when they grow up and out of Little Lamplight. I can show you the way. There's no reason to waste your time with a bunch of snot-nosed kids. Let's go now. I'm not allowed in Little Lamplight anymore. Only people under 18 get to live in Little Lamplight. So when you're done with those little kids, we can go to Big Town together. I'll wait outside for you. You want to go to Big Town? Of course you do! Oh, I forgot I had that on. It was for my birthday. Here, you take it. I don't want it anymore. It's east of Little Lamplight. Come on, let's go there. It's not that far away. We'll be there in no time. All right, yeah! Big Town, here we come. There it is. We're almost there. Come on. Yippee! Hey, who are you? Right, what do you want? Well, you can never be too careful. Be warned, it's not safe here. Super mutants have attacked recently and carried off some of our friends. Come in, just don't cause any trouble, okay? Where's Red? Where's Red? They're out there. I can feel it. Uh, what, you? I gave you the welcoming speech. There was a super mutant attack recently, and where there's one big ugly, there are ten more just waiting to grab you by the throat. Then the slavers will come and pick off what's left of your carcass and drag any survivors to Paradise Falls. Skulk up toward Germantown, near the police station. They always come from that direction. Nearby, slavers move quick and come from all directions. Someone else might know where they nest. There isn't anything here that hasn't been destroyed or dragged away. You're better off scavenging the dead out in the wasteland. There's nothing here but the stench of death and the threat of attack looming over every sunset. Two very angry types of movements. Slow, lumbering, powerful movements, and jerky, erratic, excitable movements, both coming for the kill. Sometimes you'll see small, tired dots on the horizon instead of angry, anxious ones. Those are settlers who come here from lamplight. The poor fools. Bye! A visitor? Who'd want to visit this hellhole? I'll bet you're here to rape and pillage us, aren't you? Aren't you? Not that it matters. We're all super mutant snacks anyway. The only thing you need to know is that we're all doomed. Sooner or later, they'll get every last one of us. What are you supposed to be anyway? Some kind of hero here to rescue our friends from the muties? Bah! You're just here to cause trouble. They took them north, to that old police station, in Germantown. No use in going up there, though. They've already been eaten, or worse, by now. Why? You thinking about performing a miracle and rescuing their sorry butts? Heh. <laughs> Think you're all that, huh? Well, at your own funeral, I certainly won't be attending. Yeah, I can do it. We got two things to do in this town. Suck and die. No one ever makes it in this place. You won't find any stores to loot here. Yeah, you're telling me. Everything that could go wrong goes wrong. The super mutants and slavers seem to take turns beating the crap out of us. There's no way for us to fight back, so we just keep building barricades around town. Now nah, we've been pushed back all the way. Nowhere left to run now. Most of us came from Little Lamplight. We got too old, so they kicked us out. Brats. 
Always heard stories about how great Big Town was, where the grown-ups go. But there's nothing here except death and sand. We're all gonna die! Hey, don't get any bright ideas about trying anything. We may not look it, but every one of us is a trained killer. Oh, who am I kidding? Look, we're in trouble here. If you want to help, great. If not, just please don't kill anyone while you're here. Well, we've got super mutants out that way and slavers up that way. Take your pick. They both come in here, drag off as many as they can carry, and shoot whoever puts up a fight. The best we can ever hope for is that they get here at the same time and fight over who gets to kill us. And where are we going to go? Megaton won't have us, Lamplight won't take us back, and Rivet City is too far. Besides, the bunch of us can't even hold this town. Can you imagine us schlepping across the wasteland? There aren't many of us left. There's me and Pappy. Red runs the clinic, but she's been taken by the mutant. Kimba does what she can. And there's Bittercup. She's just about as useless as a human being can be. Time Bomb was hurt in the last raid, so he's out. That's about it. The mutants and slavers have taken everyone else. Just us and a couple of guns are all that's left. Yeah, we'll see. Keep an eye out for muties. Your time is
quick! Unlock the door! You're rescuing me? Thanks! I thought we were goners for sure. I think the others are... dead. Or worse. That's right! His birthday was recently. Did he make it to Big Town already? I can't wait to see him. Everyone else is dead. We're taken away to who knows where. Well, except maybe for Shorty. They dragged him off downstairs to the kitchen a while ago. But no one comes back from the kitchen. I'm not waiting around for some super mutant to lock me up again. There's the back door somewhere around here. If you're not back soon, I'm leaving without you. If I'm not here when you come back, meet me at Big Town. Thanks. Who are you? Never mind, I don't care right now. Let's go get Red and get out of here. You lead, I'll follow. Let's go. Move it. All right, move it. Right. Hero returns. What? Don't I count for something? He rescued me at least. You never listen to me. Thanks for helping us. I just hope we can survive another attack. Probably won't. You've seen those super mutants and their appetite? There's no way Big Town will survive with them around. From the look of things, I'd say a super mutant sat down in a ditch one day and shat out this town. I dragged myself here from Lamplight. I didn't believe all the stories about Big Town, but I wasn't about to let everyone else go there without me. A few dozen attacks on the town later and here I am. Almost an ingredient in a super mutant chili cook-off. If those muties try to take me again, I'll give them something to worry about for a change. Whew. I'm glad to be safely back home. Thank you. You're a real hero, you know that? I was going to offer you a reward, but I can put the caps to use buying medicine and supplies. Thanks. I know you've already risked your life once already, but I heard the mutants talking about another attack. They'll probably be here soon. Really? That's great. What do you have in mind? Great. Let's head over to the junkyard. There's some old robots in there. Maybe you can fix them up and we'll watch to see how it's done. Go on. I'm watching. This place Show gets what worse all the time. The robots are over in the junkyard. gets worse all the time. We all used to live in a place called Little Lamplight, but they have a rule about age. You reach 16, and you're out. Didn't matter, though, because you just pack your things and head to Big Town. All the adults go there, and there's plenty to eat. 
plenty to eat, all right, if you like eating bullets. I've lost count of how many times I've been shot at. Watch out for muties and raiders. Oh, hi there. I'm Bittercup. Finally! Someone who doesn't judge me! You know, the people here are just so quick to assume that they know everything about you. I mean, like, just because I'm different doesn't mean that I'm some sort of freak, you know? It's like, hello, this world sucks. No one gets that. They're all like, blah, 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 blah. What's wrong with that girl? God, it's so nice to have someone who understands. I mean, sure, when I left Little Lamplight, I was happy to be out of there. I was dating Pappy then, you know. I got here and he was like, Big Town will be safe. But it wasn't. This place is always under attack. But I don't date liars. So I dumped his ass and got with Flash. But that didn't last very long. Me and Time Bomb were a thing for a while, too. Oh, yeah? What is it? Um, not that I care what you think. <laughs> I don't know. What does it matter anyway? We're all going to be mutant chow eventually. And what do you know? You wastelanders in your dirty clothes and roughed up faces. You look like a serial killer. You're not, um, seeing anyone right now, are you? Oh, um, well, I need to get going. But come back and visit me sometime, okay? Hi there. Um, can I help you? Whenever those things come, they grab a few people instead of killing them. No one knows what happens after that. No one wants to know. There's, there's always so much blood after they come, and then someone has to move the bodies. Oh, Little Lamplight is where most of us came from. Red and Pappy and Flash and Bittercup. We used to play together when we were kids. Then we got old and we had to leave. Those were the rules. So we packed up and headed here, like we were supposed to. No one told us it would be like this. We never have fun anymore. And most of us, most of us are dead. Later. Yeah! I made it to Big Town. Big Town, hooray! Now I you got a problem? I told her things would be safe here. How was I supposed to know all those stories were bunk? Then she dumped me, called me a liar. I was lied to myself, all right. Well, that didn't matter to her. Then she started dating Flash and got all spooky. Good riddance. Bye. I just need to find Red. Things are looking good here, bud. Bye. saved my life. Thank you. Damn. What... what happened? Wow. That's... you saved my life. Thanks. You're a good person, you know that? All right. I'll be careful. I promise. Hey, it's good to see you. Is there something I can do for you? Anything? We did? Wow. That's news to me. How long was I unconscious again? She didn't, you know, do anything to me while I was out. Did she? That might explain those weird dreams. I remember screaming and gunfire. One of those big, hulking things shot at me. That's all I can think of. 
Whoa, that was a long time ago. I'm not sure when, but everyone who grows up in lamplight ends up here. Not too many of us left. Watch yourself out there. Remember to keep an eye on the north. I got to admit, I didn't think you were one of the good ones, but what the hell? Thanks! <laughs> things might not be so bad after all. Ah, who am I kidding? There's still plenty of things out there that want to kill us. At least I didn't die today. I got you to thank for that, so thanks. Have a crappy... Ah, what the hell. Have a good one. I didn't think that'd work! You mean, we're still alive? I think I'm going to build a little shrine to you. All I need is some incense sticks and candles. Don't you judge me. It's not my fault that the only guys in this town are liars and jerks. Oh, you can't break up with me. We're all going to die soon. Well, duh. Why do you think I'm breaking up with you? When I die, the last thing I want to worry about in my afterlife is breaking up with my once alive boyfriend. Priorities. I wander around town to find chalk and makeup sometimes. Not like there's any place to buy stuff. If the mutants get you, come back and haunt me. I was starting to think that Big Town wasn't a very good place to live. But now I think we can do it, thanks to you. Well, I don't know. I guess the grown-ups built it when they got sick of little brats always hanging around them. I bet that's it. Big Town's not exactly what I thought it would be. If you ever need a sidekick, let me know. I got a lot to thank you for. I don't know how to do it. Here, take this. It's always given me good luck. I like you. Yeah, Yay! Big Die! Hooray! Die! We got those mutants good, didn't we? Go kick some ass. All right! Yeah! We sure showed those mutants, didn't we? Oh, man. Don't even go there. You'd think a girl like that would be more, you know, adventurous. But that's a dry well, my friend. All she does is talk about how she hates everyone else or how dark her clothing is. A guy can only take so much of that before he snaps. Poor Pappy got the worst of it. I swear, he's gotten even more depressed since she dumped him for me. As if being here wasn't bad enough. I showed you my new gun already, didn't I? I'm starting to feel safe for the first time in a long time. Thanks to you. Thanks again for everything. This place gets worse all the time. We did it! You did it! You helped us defeat the mutants! Oh, we'll all feel safer now. Thank you so much. Oh, that. I know all about that nonsense. Flash isn't the smartest cookie in the jar, but he deserved better than Bittercup. She wouldn't be so bad if she just faced reality instead of doing that whole spooky girl routine. 
Big Town? A fairy tale, really. The lamplighters who turn 16 aren't allowed to stay in the caves, but they have to go somewhere. And to encourage people to leave, they invented Big Town, the great grown-up place that you got to go to when you became an adult. I think you can see how true those stories were. Thanks again for saving my life at the police station. Watch the wastes. Keep track of movement. Uh, what? Did you need something? Bye. <laughs>